The Omahaws and Ole Miss. The Razorbacks playing very well, peaking perhaps some might say. Their offense is rolling at 45 and 20. Ole Miss the last team in, but they haven't lost a game this postseason. Something's got to get. A web hammers this to left. Already an issue. It's over the left fielder's head. Graham. I don't think the sun had anything to do with it, but a hard hit double. Braden Webb, his fifth, and Hogs on base. Two outs, two strikes. And another pop-up, right field. Harris, and Gaddis is already walking off the field. First time Arkansas has been held scoreless in the first inning. Hagan Smith. Well, he was a mainstay in this rotation for a lot of the season, but like a lot of freshmen, pitch on the weekend consistently over the course of the year. The umpire behind the plate. Playable for Webb in center field. Bench retired. Lefty Graham waits. 3 2. Way outside. He tried to throw him a breaking pitch and a walk. And, uh, oh, and 2. Breaking pitch popped up. And the center fielder, Webb, comes in to make the play. Only a walk. Each team had a base runner, and they could get no further than first. We're through. This one to left, going back is Graham, still going back, looks up for get it off the top of the wall. Is it a homer? It looked like it got over, and it did. Home run, Chris Lanzilli hit over the yellow line, and the Hogs score first. Lanzilli's third in Omaha. It's 1-0. Head in the zone long. Watch this, how he keeps it in the zone, just gets it out in front. Always thinking right center. Barrels it by hitting out in front. This ball just takes off. Graham actually broke in and then across. Watch this ball just hit the top. Go right over. Come right back in. Good call. Kemp Alderman. This ball hammered to left and high. Drifting. Gregory right at the wall. He watches it go over. That's a home run for Alderman. His 11th. And like that, we are tied. Kemp Alderman. Put on about 30 pounds. Got that arm back. And recovered from Tommy John surgery. Picks up the strike. Chase there and a good meeting from Hobbs after that three strikes. Saw it, and I saw one get ripped into left field. That's going to be a hit with two down for Caden Wallace. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Get a veteran to come in and transfer like Turner. And hard to replace him, but it makes it a little easier. Yep, running back, and there to make the play is Justin Bench. Turner is retired. They will strand one. There is kind of fun to play. Exactly. Yeah. exactly. <laughs> so they were yep. all trying to... Gonzalez is gone. He strikes him out. Big strikeout for him at Oxford. 0 2. Chase is there. How about Smith? How about that pitch? He shook the first. We're going to get a slider here? Yes. We do. After the leadoff walk to bench, he punches out Gonzalez, Elko, and Graham. In particular, the bullpen. First pitch swinging, and that's a good start. And Alderman is aboard. He's two for two. A home run. There it, is. there it is. Yep. Sixth punch out for Hagen Smith. Mm. Dunhurst is struck out again. He's 0 for 8. He's got two strikeouts. He did, man. He has been dynamite with that pitch. Picks up another strikeout. That is his eighth. Going 2 0 oh, goes away. If the two and one team forces another one. Center field carrying yard work. Oh man, the first one we have seen out of Charles Schwab field to center off the bat of Calvin Harris. Stay hot. Check that, check that. Brady Slavens, Brady Slavens. To the eight hole from the two spot. Fastball straight down the middle. My man barreled it. And we're talking about the wind blowing in. It did not matter. No. I don't think I've seen a center fielder's no. number yet. 
Like the freshman did it today. Five innings, gave up just two hits. One was a solo home run, but he leaves with the lead and gives way to another lefty. You know, he's looming out there. These are the big innings for Arkansas and Ole Miss. Points less this year against lefties. There's mm. a reason why Arkansas started that way. A take from Chatnier to even to count back at 101. Laced in a left field. That one's going to get down. Giving chase is Gregory. Hitting first, going to second, and now he puts the brakes on as that was fired back in. Good job by Gregory to get it and throw it quick. Got him with that slider again. Man, a frustrating night for Dunhurst. Really good pitching. They have struck out 10 Ole Miss hitters. Season for Slavens, who's ready on a 2-0. This one into left, dropping quickly. Two for two with a walk. And remember, it was Stovall who was hitting in the eighth spot. Slavin's in the two spot. You take your ball back. I got, I got a real one. <laughs> this one's better. This is a good one. Tough play. Stovall retired. Jacob Gonzalez continues to play well. Washburn pitches well. Right field and played perfect. Manzilli was in and he's there for the out. Yep, he's gone and that was quick work from Evan Taylor. Two down in the seventh. She's reached once on a walk. On the ground, nice short hop fielded by Wallace. Great play by the third baseman. And Evan Taylor manages to get through the seventh without any issues. Tiger, anybody's ball game, 2-1. Next one to Wallace. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, right through Wood at third base. And heading to second base. Safe, the call is at second, Wallace. And of course. But it, it crossed his feet. His legs, he's out at second. No, he's not. I got the hand in there, Eddie. You yeah, got the hand in there? I think he's safe. Hand, I yeah, got it let's in. Let's check it out. Hand. Ooh, wow, that's close. Right. That is really close. <laughs> I think the first look. And this one is off the glove of Gonzalez, and that's going to allow Wallace to score. And a fist pump at first base from Michael Turner. A huge, huge insurance run. Third run. And there's a really good bunt. Wood bare hands. He's got no play, and he left third base open. Momentum is all with the Hogs right now. Oh, man. Beautiful bunt. Wood to first. They will get more second and third. One down. Robert Moore. They will intentionally walk Jalen Battles. The bases will be loaded. Intentionally walked. 0-2 to Slavens. Got him! Oh. Big strikeout for Jack Doherty. No. He got him! Doherty back-to-back -back punches off Slavens and Diggs, and they will leave them loaded. You can go left, right, left. Gonzalez, Elko, Graham. Moore oh, playing boy. real deep, has to charge, and he knew it, man. He had that clockwork, and he starts in shallow right field. And Two balls, two strikes, and he got him. Nasty pitch. Elko retired. Two big outs. They know there's a huge game going on here, though. Well, he's going so fast. He's trying to get home so he can watch the end. Battles, and how about the job that Taylor just did? On and relief. Woo, Pig Suey. They are three outs away from a rematch tomorrow night. Alderman, Chatagne, Dunhurst. Right field, wouldn't you know it, leadoff single. For Kemp Alderman, his third hit of the game. Now you go to this cat, it was really good stuff. Brady Tiger, the freshman closer, fastball into the mid-90s, and a wipeout curveball. Watch out, that one got him, he didn't have to move very much. He let it go, and it's two on, winning run to the plate, nobody out, bottom nine. That one, did that get him too? Yeah, it hit him too, and now the bases are loaded. Back-to-back -back hit batters. And 
it is just a brutal situation here with the bases loaded, nobody out. That's it. A. Van Horn has already signaled for the lefty to come in. He's not going to allow Tiger to finish it. Zach Morris, it's your ball game. Ole Miss down two, bases loaded. They win. Remember, it was just a few days ago that Zach Morris, Zach Morris got the start against this team. And ultimately, it was just his second start of the year. That start didn't go very well. Lasted just two thirds of an inning. Got him! That's a big, big strikeout from Morris Leatherwood after falling behind 2-0. Popped up, going out and coming in. Boroff, watch out! They run into each other. It's caught by Boroff and the left fielder. And, ooh, were they lucky there. Battles ran right into him, and he uh, held on to it. All his. Battles has to know where he's at. He's playing more up the middle. He's going full out for this baseball. He's calling it, but this ball belongs to the left fielder, Boroff. Stays with it. What focus, and he's able to keep the runners exactly where they were. The bases are still loaded. Two outs for Justin Bench. Man, oh man. 39 RBIs for Bench. First pitch, ground ball in the hole. Battles has it. No play. They get one. And now it's 3-2. Smart play by Battles to eat it. Keep it in the infield. That's all you can do right there with Two. Battles. Into left field, it's elevated and caught, and that will do it. We will play again tomorrow afternoon. What a job by Zach Morris as he picks up the freshman Tiger, and it forces a winner-take-all game to get into the finals tomorrow. Arkansas 3, Ole Miss 2. Best game we've had at this 2022 World Series. They rolled the dice the other day when they rolled Zach Morris out there in the starting roll, just his second start of the year. More comfortable in this spot, but he came in and the house was on fire. He put the fire out. We'll see each other again tomorrow night.